Well then, we should go too, huh, boys? Ha ha ha! Heh heh heh! Whoa! Thank goodness they all have a unique laugh to tell them apart. Let's go, Solo. We need to hurry. I know this place. According to the legend, the Pokemon Yuxi can wipe clean the memories of others. Crystal Lake is just in a cave, but the entrance is apparently stairs underneath a crystal, so it could be considered underground. Ah, okay. I couldn't remember exactly how Crystal Lake worked. It's been too long. Are these two things really just a coincidence? Oh my goodness, it's so loud. I thought that I turned off that sound. I could have sworn that I turned that off. Thank you for the two bits, Blazing Scully. I appreciate it. I tested this the other day and the sound was off. Is it just whenever I start streaming, it turns the sound back on? How? This makes no sense. Just a second, I'm trying to figure out how to... Because it's way too loud, but I don't understand why. But I hate it. I'm, f I'm more than glad to have the bit donation like message pop up and be like, hey, person donated. I'm all for that, but like, it's got to stop being so loud. I'm not seeing how I can fix it. I I've got to get that worked out. I really just need to sit down for like an hour or something and focus on getting new noises put in instead of these default ones. Whatever, I'll worry about it later. Maybe I came here before I lost my memory. Then maybe I met Yuxi, and he wiped my memory clean. Could that have happened? Hey, Solo! Why do you keep drifting off like that? It's not like you. Hurry, let's get ready and go into the forest. Zoltaron, what's up, man? Glad to see you. Dude, I love how they use Yuxi in this game. It's so good. It's just another reason that this is, like, one of my favorite games. And is my favorite Pokemon game. Let's mess around with Kangaskhan Rock for a second here. Alright, definitely put away the gummies. Uh, put away the stamina bands for now and the P.E.K.K.A. Scarf. I'm gonna keep the Petrify Orb just in case. Definitely put away Recycle. We need to have that later in the game. Don't need the Elixir. Don't need the Decoy Orb. Don't need this many Sleep Seeds. Put away one Orin Berry. That should do it. Leaves us plenty of space. Alright. Wigglytuff. Oh, I wish the gang would report in soon. Ah, this is exciting. Ah, you two. You have yet to leave. Get ready quickly, then be on your way. Ah, by the way. You can use the Kangaskhan Rock to store and take out all your items. And to save your progress. So you should try using the Kangaskhan Rock to sort out your inventory. No matter how you choose to do that, just get ready quickly, then head out. Thank you for saying save, because I totally forgot to save. Save up. I wish I had a better memory too, Armdor. One of the few things I'm good at remembering is video game stuff. Uh, definitely the Foggy Forest. Like, obviously. Bring Blast Seeds? Probably should have grabbed some Blast Seeds, but I think we'll be fine. I'm a water and a grass type. We're not going to have any trouble against Groudon when we get to him. Alright, Foggy Forest it is. Let's roll out. Transform. Roll out. Anyway. I'm just going to stop here and think to myself a little bit. Maybe the keys to unlocking my memory are here. Fogbound Lake. I may find some answers if Fogbound Lake can be found. Huh? What is this? How do you keep finding all these magic rocks? It looks like some kind of stone, I guess. It's red and pretty. It's kind of like a gem, actually. Yeah, Groudon is not... The Groudon that you fight here is not that difficult. Wow, this stone feels warm. It's like heat is coming from inside the stone. It's weird. It doesn't seem to be a lava. What could it be? It might be rare. I'll keep it. All right, let's roll solo. We have the magic fire rock. Oh no, my electric moves are weakened. The magic fire rock. Distant cousin to the magic rock. I'm going to follow this Pachirisu. It's going to take me right to the exit. Doesn't even know it. I knew it. You foolish creature. No! I want the experience. Oh, you idiot. Goodbye. Easy knockout. Dude, 150 almost experience? That's crazy. Oh, 
All my poor electric type moves that my Totodile knows can't be used at all. Bow, now, bow, now, bow. Hello, Skiplum. I hate you and all that you stand for. You're not allowed on my... I forgot that Splash actually does that in this game. You're not allowed in my stream. Get out of here. Get this fog off my screen. Where are my stairs? Is it too much to ask for a set of stairs around this place? Hey, Blast Seed. There you go, Stephanism. I got one. Just like you asked. We're good to go now. Nothing can possibly go wrong now that I have a singular Blast Seed. Hello, money. Always glad to find some money. Turtwig, that was just unnecessary, but you know what? You got us experience, so it's okay. Oh my word. What is that hallway? Honey, where are my stairs? This place looks familiar. I wonder if I've ever been here before. Down this way, I hope. It is. This stupid little squirrel thing. Goodbye. Hey, gummy. Don't mind if I do. We need to go make some uh, smoothies in today's stream, probably. Rip Pikachu players. Yeah, that's what you get for choosing Pikachu. Grass gummy. Very nice. Good for my boy Turtwig. Oh, Michael. By the way, I'll tell you this right now because it's gonna save you some annoyance later. If you plan on continuing to play more and more Explorers of Sky. But uh, whenever you get blue gummies, I think you need to save like three of them for a post-game thing that you have to do. You might actually only need two, but I think three. I can't remember. Is it blue gummies? Yeah, it's blue gummies you need, I think. Dang it, Chaos, I have a job and you're making me want to replay Explorers of Sky. I blame you. I can't help it that this is one of the greatest video games ever made in the history of time. I'm trying to think, and it might, like, actually be the best game on the DS ever? I'm trying to think of any other DS games that are, like, really good. How do you miss a Razor Leaf? Oh my goodness, that pack. I should have hit you with something stronger, but thankfully you died to tackle. That damage. Come on. Don't worry, Turtwig. You're fine. Don't worry. Get out of here. Hey, okay, wait a minute. I changed my mind. Come back. I want your experience. Yeah, that'll do it. Ooh. Another box. Heal up Turtwig here. <gasps> That's a threat. I'm out. It is blue gummies? All right, I thought so. Do you need two or three? Gotta ask Cass, why do you hate Pikachu? I, I hate Pikachu because he's... I don't really think he's adorable, first of all. And second of all, I'm sick of seeing him all the time. And also, he just sucks. Chaos almost died to Bayloom. Yeah, then I had to kill a Bayloom. I just don't like Pikachu. Also, younger me resented Ash for never evolving it, because Raichu is way better. Do, do, do. Pinsir, do you mind? Make sure you die because you're a threat. You lived a water gun. Unheard of. Get out of here. That pincer could have destroyed everything. Razor Leaf that. Razor Leaf, please. Okay, well, you suck. I asked one simple thing of you. Unfortunate. Well, he's going to get away with that poke, but what are you going to do? Hey! Level 15. Wait, but what move am I learning? Oh, who cares about Scary Face? Well, actually, Scareface is pretty good in this game. You know what? I'd rather have Scareface than Rage. Lowering a boss's speed can be pretty useful, but I'll probably get rid of it for an actual attack at some point. You know what? Goodbye. Oh, hey, we made it. Sick. I've never played Fantasy Life. Give me like a three sentence summary on what Fantasy Life is. What kind of a game is it? I wanna know. Yeah, Raichu is way better, I agree. 
It's incredible. The water is coming down and waterfalls all over the place. Yeah, where do you think those waterfalls are coming from? But where are we? Is this the deepest part of the forest? Huh, the fog is so thick. I can't tell which way we can go. Hey, hey, hey. Look, it's Corefish. Yo, my boy. It's the spirit of RTK. Hey, hey, you two find any clues? No, nothing yet. How about you, Corefish? I've got nothing here either. Don't let it get you down. But there is something here that's kind of interesting. Interesting. There, have a look for yourself. What an impressive statue. W what What is this? I don't know. It seems to be a statue of a Pokemon. Life but better equals fantasy life. Alright, well, you know, that's all I need to know. Sounds pretty sick. He had a Torterra but lost the league. Unacceptable. Torterra is great. I don't care if Pikachu has a I'm not saying that... Raichu is stronger than Pikachu. I don't care about the light ball. The fact that they pander to Pikachu and is like, hey, let's give Pikachu an item that doubles its attack stats makes me hate it even more. It's idiotic. Give Raichu an item that makes it better. Raichu looks cooler and is better. What kind of Pokemon is that? I've never seen a Pokemon like that before. Look at that fancy uh, plate right there. You should read that. Oh? Is something inscribed here? It's in footprint runes. Let me read it. Uh, reignite the life that burned within Groudon. Then the sky shall blaze with the sun's heat. Thank goodness you can make out this garbage. The path to treasure shall be revealed. There are not enough footprints here to make out all of the words that you just said. The path to treasure. That's incredible. Oh, Solo. Treasure? Could this mean the treasure of Fogbound Lake? Uh, what other treasures are going to be talking about, my dude? The path to treasure shall be revealed. So this means the secret to finding Fogbound Lake could be hidden right here. Hey, 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 you think so? Hey, hey, now that's a mystery we've got to solve. Corefish, we in this together now, bro. This part of the footprint runes. This part about life that burned within Groudon. What's this about? So this Groudon, is it this statue? Hey, hey, so we're supposed to what? Ignite the life that was in this statue? Yeah, but ignite the life? How do we do that? Huh. Huh? Wait a second. I know. Touch this statue, Solo. Maybe you'll see something. I was thinking that too. If it means finding the path to Fogbound Lake, if it means finding the key to my own past, if the answers are held by this statue, you're gonna do it. We in this. Feeling anything, Solo? Oh, here we go. It's coming. That dizzy feeling. That's it. It's here. It's here. The time gear. What? What was that? Whose voice was that? What? Again? So soon after the first one. I see. Place the drought stone in Groudon's heart. That lifts the fog. Very well done. Good job, partner. What did I just pick up on? That was different from what I've gotten before. This time I only heard a voice. And I don't know whose voice that was. That voice... Whose voice was that? I didn't even get a sense of what the voice really sounds like. But it still bugs me for some reason. Are you alright, Solo? Did you see something? What did that voice say? Remember. That voice said... It said place the drought stone in Groudon's heart. By the way, when you know that Groval's voice actor in the English anime was Yami Yugi's voice, isn't that, uh... Dan... Dan Green is his name, I think. He was a good English voice actor. If that is who I think it is. I'm pretty sure Dan Green is the name of the guy who voiced, uh, Yami Yugi. 
Yo, what do I do with the boxes? Michael, keep the boxes. You have to uh, pay... I don't remember what NPC it is, but there's an NPC, I think it's Zatu, in Treasure Town that will open the boxes for you. They usually have rare items in them. It said place the drought stone in Groudon's heart. Then said, yeah, store them, store them so you don't lose them, and then eventually you can open them up and you get rare items from them. They give you items that you normally can't find any other way. The They give you specific, like... Pokemon specific items that when they hold it boosts to uh, special stats and stuff like that. Wigglytuff is an amazing character in this game, I agree. Oh, Zatu is here already? You might already have access to him. You should get him to open them. King Crimson, how's it going? Glad to see you. That lifts the fog. Wait a second. Droughtstone? Is that maybe? Uh, huh? What is this? Oh, good. I got a cutscene of what I saw like literally 15 minutes ago. Looks like some kind of stone, I guess. It's red and pretty. Okay, yeah, we, we just saw this a minute ago. I don't need to read this again. Yeah, it's like 150 poke to open up a chest. Dawn Fan Fang. Yep, there you go. Could the drought stone be? Maybe it's that stone Turtwig found. Garclaw, I don't know what this is. Those are items like Dawn Fan is for Dawn Fan. Garclaw must be uh, Garchomp. You give it to those Pokemon when you have them on their team, and then they get boosts to uh, stats that are really good for them. Cass, do you know how to mute the game when playing on an emulator? It depends on what emulator you're playing. I have no idea. Oh, here. There's a small hollow in the statue's chest. Normally, when I want to mute something like an emulator, I just open the volume mixer in Windows and mute that uh, window. There's a small hollow in the statue's chest. Did you figure something out, Solo? What? That stone I found at the base camp? You want me to fit that stone into the statue's chest? Sure, I'll try it. So I should put it into this indentation. Yeah, what could go wrong? Oh, it's mad. We upset it. Ah, watch out! Step back, everyone! Playing on Desmume? I also use Desmume, but like I said, whenever I want to mute it, I just open up Volume Mixer and mute it that way, so I have no idea what to tell you. Nothing to the part for partners that I have yet, though. Michael, that's how it goes a lot of the time. You get them that you can't use at the time, but it's mostly those are mostly good for post-game because that's when you start collecting a bunch of party members and being able to evolve party members and stuff like that. Hey, hey, the fog is gone. Absorb it into the rock. Have the magic rock absorb the entire Groudon statue. That way we can, through it, use Groudon's powers. I like the idea. That's what we should do. The sky cleared. I'm guessing if I had a Gibble, the Garclaw wouldn't work right. It needs to be fully evolved. Yes, there's an item for Gibble specifically. I think there's, for all 492 Pokemon you can get in the game, they all have their own unique one. Gibble has its own unique item. Garchomp has its own unique item. Etc, etc. The sunlight's harsh. Like, for instance, if you get an item specifically for Grottle, then your Turtwig won't be able to use it. You have to have the Turtwig item. And so on and so forth. Hey, look! Both of you, look up. Hey, hey, what is that? Just looked at the info and it says gives benefits for Gibble, Gabite, and Garchomp. Does it? Maybe I'm thinking of the first game? I could have sworn that it was only for the one specific Pokemon. Maybe I'm remembering wrong. Pikachu has one too, Chaos? Yeah, all Pokemon do. Is it for all of them, Michael? That's wild. I thought that it was uh, for a specific one. Wish I picked Bulbasaur because I have a Venusaur Claw. You'll get a Turtwig at him eventually. That's what the fog was hiding. It's no wonder Fogbound Lake evaded discovery for all this time. We were just wandering around in circles, too. Hey, hey, so you're saying... You're saying Fogbound Lake is up there? Yes, that's what I think. Fogbound Lake has to be up there. Yeah, I'd say that's a pretty safe bet. How does this structure not fall apart? Chaos is thinking of time and darkness. Oh, in time and darkness, it's for each specific mon. And then in Sky, they changed it to where it affects the entire evolutionary line. Okay, thank you, Stephanism. They were improved in Sky. Thank you. Now I don't feel insane anymore. <laughs> I did play... I played Explorers of Time before I played Sky. Like, I got Explorers of Time when it came out. So I had it before... 
Explorers of Sky. So sometimes some of the things that they improved on in Sky, I don't realize have been improved upon because I still remember how it was in Time and Darkness. Magic is held up by magic. Hey, hey, this is no time to be gawking. I'll let everyone in the guild know. You two go on ahead. My man Corfish just helping out. I love it. All right, let's move on, Solo. Onward to Fogbound Lake. Hold it. Oh, it's these nerds again. You brutes. Good job. Da ha ha. Da ha ha, you solved the mystery. You're no longer of use to us. Ha ha ha, we'll swipe the treasure thanks to you. You fiends. So that's why you joined the expedition. You planned this all along. Da ha, you expected anything less? Da ha, sorry to say it, but we'll have to get rid of you right here. We'll make you eat those words. We'll stop you from getting to Fogbound Lake. Ah ha ha, you've already forgotten our last showdown. Let me remind you how you lost a coughing in me. You were destroyed by our noxious gas special combo. Ugh. You're destined to fail again. Aha, enough talking. Take this. Me and coughing's noxious gas special combo. That's so hard to say. Ah, wait, wait for me. What? Perfect apple, perfect apple. My boy Wiggly Top. I finally caught you, my perfect apple. Wait, what, I just got an egg some rando just handed their baby off to me? Welcome to Explorers of Sky, Michael. If my perfect apple went away, I would, I would. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, you two. And my friends too. Everyone's all together. Yay! Yay! G Guildmaster, what are you doing here? Huh? What am I doing? I was taking a walk in the forest. Then my perfect apple went rolling and rolling away from me. So I ran and ran and ran, and here I am. Oh, yes. How did that apple roll for so long? You two shouldn't be dawdling here, should you? Huh? You two have a job, don't you? To explore the forest, right? Go on, then. Off you go. But... Where is Chadot? Did Digglytuff... Uh, Digglytuff? I can't talk. Did Wigglytuff ditch him in the forest? Would you not ditch Chatot in the forest? I know I would. You don't want to listen to your guildmaster? Boo! Boo! Hurry, get exploring. Uh, okay. Let's go, Solo. Alright, we out. See you later. Good luck. Oh, I hope we get some good news soon. Oh, I hope we get some good news soon indeed. La la la, I accidentally read it twice. Uh, Guildmaster. No, Michael, you can't eat the Pokemon egg. That's cannibalism in this universe. What is wrong with you? Huh? What's the matter, friend? We were thinking that we should go explore as well. Oh? That's all right. I can't trouble my friends like that. We'll let those two do the exploring. Let's wait for the report. La la la. Chief, this is getting really weird. Team Rock Cult's gonna beat us to the prize if we don't do something. What do we do? We have to do something. We have no choice. We'll take down Wigglytuff right now. Then we'll chase down Team Rock Cult. But do you think it'll be all right? Wigglytuff is like, creepy. Don't worry about it, he's no big deal. Besides, River has it Wigglytuff has an unbelievably precious treasure. Oh really? Treasure? That's right, I was planning on mugging him for it anyway, so this is a good opportunity. Hey Coffin, prepare for the noxious gas special combo. You stupid idiots, you're about to be obliterated. Namiwa nan Shindaru. Wigglytuff is really gonna get it. Insert skun tank shouting, Nani! No hard feelings, but the great famous explorer Wrigglytuff. Wrigley? <laughs> Wigglytuff? I can talk. I don't have a Gatorade today, by the way. I ran out and I forgot to get one before stream today, so I don't have a drink. It's finished! Cha ha! Chapter 9 The Mystery of Fogbound Lake. This game is so beautiful. Hey, I see it, Solo. See, there's a big fissure. 
Oh, I love this music. It's so ominous, and it's such a good build-up to getting to the top of this place, where you just run into a friggin' Groudon. I guess we can enter through here. Is that steam? I wonder if it's gonna be really hot in there, you think? But it's too late to get cold feet. I'm shaking with anticipation, Solo. What awaits inside? And what awaits us on the top? I can't even imagine what's in store for us. Wait, insert ear rape death? Wait, what? Did the... My mic didn't mess up again, did it? Because I thought we fixed that last stream. It's plugged in all the way. Oh, just referencing the meme. My bad. <laughs> I fell behind a little bit. My mistake. Alright, I'm sorry. It's Of all the times for that meme to happen, the day after I just fixed a problem where my mic kept having audio issues, it made me worry. That's my mistake. We're heading into a place where no one has ever gone before. That makes my pulse race. Don't be weird about it, Turtwig. Let's go, Solo. Let's go inside and climb upward. Let's mess with the Kangaskhan rock first. I have four boxes now. I hope I get some good stuff from them. Uh, I don't need the scanner orb. Definitely put away the gummies. Make sure we don't lose them. I don't need two heal seeds. I haven't even needed one so far. I'll keep the one reviver seed just in case. And I'll keep the one blast seed. Alright. Let's try our best, Solo. Wigglytuff is Xeno from Dragon Ball. Crazy. Back at the Groudon statue. Psst. Hey, Chief. What's going on? Something wrong? Chief. Hey, Chief. You've been staring him down for how long now? Come on. Let's you and I give him a double dose of the old noxious gas. Shh. Shut your yap. Dear friends, what's wrong? You've been making such scary faces at me. Ah, this guy's tough. Really tough. I get it. You're trying to make me laugh with silly faces. I love Wigglytuff so much. He's too pure for this world. I bet I can make you laugh too. Blah, blah, blah. Come on, Chief. I can't take this. This whole weird scene is freaking me out. Okay, then. This isn't working, and we're out of options. Hey, Wigglytuff. What is it, what is, what is, what is, what is it? Hey, no hard feelings, but you're going down. Take this. A noxious gas special. Straight from me and coughing. You fools. You are already dead. Alright. Let's get moving. This is our first uh, dungeon that's uh, dark, isn't it? Where you have the little light just around your body. I think this is the first one we run into. Steam Cave is also the first one you run into. Why is there a cricket tune in Steam Cave? Like, come on. But, uh... What was I about to say? This is the first one that has a halfway point, isn't it? The first dungeon with a halfway point? I think this, this area has one. Fix that attack stat up. Stay right there, Turtwig. I just want to see. I gotta get the gummy. It's dangerous leaving my boy Turtwig alone like this, but we will meet again. Hopefully soon. Turtwig, are you near the thing? This is just a long corridor, huh? On Fort? Turtwig, did you find it? I should have looked at him sooner. Whatever. Still no stairs. Less than ideal.jpg. How have neither of us run into a Pokemon to fight? Oh, hey, Snubble. Turtwig, hey, I see you down there. Why Fire Fang on the water type, though? All right, Turtwig. Let's get out of here. Should look around for Energy Ball. Can Energy Ball spawn in here? Didn't I already get an Energy Ball TM? Or did I see the opportunity to buy it, but I didn't? Can't remember. What on earth? A far-fetched. 
All right, well, good job. Hey, level 15. I got it here. It's how I beat the Groudon fake. Huh. But, like, I have Water Gun and Razor Leaf, so I feel like I don't really need it. Come on. I'll try and keep an eye out for it, but I'm not... See, I just went out of my way for it on this floor, and it was all a waste of time. Steam Cave, fourth floor. Revive? Nope, stun. Alright, good enough. Blowback Orb is not really worth it. Hello. Ah, you stupid flame-bodied scumbag. How dare you. Why? Like, why, though? 